Hey everybody, my name is Tyler Watson, your Las Vegas and Henderson Realtor. This is Tour Time with Tyler and let's check out this model. So we are up here in Nova Ridge, up by Summerlin. This home right here is five bedroom, four and a half bath, great room den, bonus room, plus a three car garage. You have two here, one over there. Now this model has already been sold. They sold it for about 1.8 million. You can go ahead and buy this home, this model, but it will only cost you $852,000. So they threw in about a million dollars worth of options. Love this siding. This is a pretty neat home. Let's go ahead and take it on inside. Interesting color on the door. Really love this staircase right here. But you'll have to wait and see the views. So one of the cool things about this home is right here. It is basically a next gen suite. So if we come on right here, this is your third bay car garage. Go ahead. And what's neat is you actually have a washer dryer right here. So like I said, multi-gen room if you wanna do that. Right here we have a really nice sitting area and it even has a kitchenette. You have a microwave, you have a fridge. They put the wine fridge, because you know people in Vegas like to have a good time. Swinging around, you have a nice size living area. Again, really nice thing about these homes up here is there's so much natural light with the windows. We come straight across, you come into the bedroom. So if you have parents who you want to move in with you or if you have kids who want a little bit more space, it's not quite a casita, but they do have their own room, bathroom. Love this, they did this really long hexagon. So you have a three quarter bath in here. Again, they went with the darker tiles and the black hardware everywhere. It's what's in right now. And right here you have a really nice size closet. It is a walk-in, but you'll have to see what this home has in store, especially the master closet. Let me know, what do you think of these stairs? I'm kind of particular. If you don't know, my father's a carpenter, so I love this wood look. By the way, if you could do me a huge favor, if you could hit that like button, subscribe if you're enjoying these. If you have any questions, all of my info is down in the description below. Right here is your powder room. So they did wallpaper, you have a nice little vanity, toilet, and they even did pendant lighting in here. We swing back on out. This is your coat closet, but you'll have to see this room. So they have this awesome lighting hanging. They have this huge fireplace. Love the beam work up above. There's even a sunk in lounge sitting room over there, more beams, but check out this kitchen. Very, very nice. Make sure to stay tuned for this master closet. I ran through it real quick, it is insane. So right here, tons of cabinet space. They went for the espresso with the white countertops and they actually did two-tone if you notice right here, they're all black. Along the back wall, they're all black, and they did a gray, or excuse me, brown, with this neat little sitting area. Haven't seen this look in a while. What do you think about a built-in seating bench? So Big Island, with this, you can't do any bar stools, but take a look at this fridge. I love this. They did the black stainless everywhere for the appliances. Nice size fridge, this is huge. They did, your double oven, and right here you even have a little butler's pantry. So more storage, they did two-tone again, so you can see both what's in the kitchen and on, excuse me, the island, and along the backside. This is your two-car garage, and very nice pantry. We come around, let's stay, uh, let's stay with the island first. Really nice dishwasher and undermounted sink. Again, they went with Blanco, the $600 to $800 option, but this is what you're gonna see 
from washing your dishes. We'll get over to the dining area here in a second. Just wanna show you this awesome cooktop. So you have four burners plus the griddle, the teppanyaki, and a huge fume hood. Let me know what you think. Do you like the open just shelves or would you actually want full cabinet? It's really pretty in the models, but ooh, that loses a lot of cabinet space and you always have to get, have it clean. Let's take a look at these. Really nice, quiet, soft closing. You have more storage right here. So it's almost like you have a second little pantry. Let me just pan around so you can see this kitchen. Pretty neat. I'm curious, what are your thoughts on the built-in bench? Again, it's kind of a older style, but neat. So they went ahead and blew out that whole wall. So you have another slider right there. Here is your dining area. This is big. And let's go ahead and head on to the back side of that fireplace. Right here you have a four panel slider. It's gonna completely open up. You have a pool. The views are really nice. Check this out. I doubt we can go out back. Actually, let's see if we can sneak out over here. Usually when there's a pool, they don't want people going out back unless there's a net over it. So let me see. And that's the case. So we'll stay right here so you can see the backyard. You have a barbecue area, nice covered patio. You even have this whole sitting area. That's so cool. I don't know if you can see it. So you have benches right here. So you could sit basically pool level. Try to get back around over here to let you have a better idea of what it looks like. So yeah, right here you can see there's even a little fridge down there. Pretty neat. If you wanted to, you could even put a uh, above ground jacuzzi up there and there is some really nice strip views. I'll show you here in a minute when we come around. So nice fire pit. These are usually like $15,000 options and coming into this sunk down area. Check this out. So it already has everything you need to have fun right here. These are fridges. You have a little wet bar sitting sink. Again, they chose that same cabinetry style with the shelves. Love the beam look. And they put the TV on this side. So you could do more formal sitting and more informal. Pretty neat. Let's come back around and take it on upstairs. Just one more look. Like this. These homes are a little bit more cozy feeling rather than that ultra modern. I absolutely love this with the wood look. And they did flagstone all the way up. Now as always, if you have any questions, all of my info is down in the description below. If you'd like to see any homes, resale, new, give me a call, I'd love to help you out. I don't know if you can see, it's probably too bright. You can actually see the strip from here. Again, they did the beam work. How cool is that with the iron work right there? But this is your view from up above. You look down on everyone. Up at the top, you have this huge loft. I really like this tenant or uh, ping pong table. That had to be expensive with the wood. Now there are two more models for sale. Let me know if you'd like to see them. They do come with all of the furniture. So another reason why they're so much more expensive. <laughs> all you have to do is bring your pillow and toothbrush. So you have cabinetry right here for storage. And let's come on into this room. Super cool. They actually have a theater. Love the coffered ceilings, but they're not truly coffered. They did all of this beam work. Really neat. They put shutters up here. There's even a little step up so you can get the elevation and another wet bar area. Let's take a step up just so you can see what this looks like. Pretty neat. Love the ceiling. And let's come on out. Touch any scene. Oh, you can change the experience. It'll probably make it lighter, darker. So they went crazy with the washer dryers. Lots of wallpaper. You even get the sink and same cabinets as down below. Do you guys uh, need two washers and dryers or two sets? Let me know. So real quick before we keep going, here's your view from this side. 
you can peek on into the kitchen. If we swing right around, here's the bathroom for the upstairs bedrooms. Double vanity, they did Kohler up here. Still very nice, undermounted sink. It's almost like, a, not a gold, but titanium nitride kind of look to it. You have pendant lighting, backsplash all the way over there. More of a flat texture, it has some, like the Santa Fe look going. Your toilet and your full bath, again with that more gold color hardware. We continue on, let's come on into this bedroom. Now this bedroom actually has a balcony, <laughs> really nice views. So they did the shiplap look on the back. You have a three panel slider for your closet. And let's just step out onto this balcony. Can we? So it already has the ceiling fan. This balcony is massive for a secondary room. I've seen bedrooms almost this size. But let's take a look at these views. You have mountains all the way around. The strip is right there. And again, my camera is all the way zoomed out. It is very prominent. Awesome sure views. This would be really neat for 4th of July or New Year's to watch all the fireworks up here. Let's come on out, go to the master. And again, like I said, take a look at this closet. It's insane. So right here, before we get into the master, you have the last bedroom. Really, really nice. So that one had the really nice bal or the balcony. This one's a suite. It has its own bathroom, same type of closet. Let me show you this. So nice vanity. They tiled the entire back of that wall toilet and you have a Another shower, so three quarter bath in here. Again, just so you can see how big this room is, it's large. I've seen masters almost this size, but let's take it on into the master. How cool is this wood right here? Oh, there's someone out back, how do you get over there? So before we get into the bedroom, take a look at this bathroom. So very nice, they did the black tile again on the floor. You have dual shower heads, you have the bench, a uh, toweling off area, so you don't have to get the floor all wet. You have one vanity right here, again, pendant lighting, one vanity right here. You have your linen storage. Straight across from that, you have your toilet area, and then one of the nicest closets I've seen. Now, I'll give you the full tour of this. So. Hanging room right here. There's even a little cubby up above. If you turn around, more storage, more hanging, more shelves, drawers. This just keeps getting more and more insane. And it keeps going. So bigger cupboards, bigger drawers, more hanging, more shelving. You have your shoe area for days. And then you even have the Closed off ones for the expensive shoes. But how cool is that? You put your Louboutins in there. So as always, make sure to hit that like button. Let's head right on into the actual bedroom itself. We'll go out in the balcony. I'll zoom on in so you can see the strip. But check out this room. I love this beam work. I love the flooring. I really like this house. Again, this one has already been sold. They still have this floor plan available, but if you want to option it up, just to let you know, there's about a million dollars worth of options and upgrades in this home. So whole wall is basically a slider. It's funny, the balcony on the secondary room is bigger than this one. This one's longer, but the other one's deeper. And here's your view. So mountains all around. Let's zoom on in so you can see just how close. So that's your view right there. Very, very nice. So as always, if you have questions about any of these homes, you wanna see a new one, you wanna see resales, all my info is down in the description below. 
If you could do me a huge favor, hit that like button if you're enjoying these. I just crossed over 100 subscribers. Really excited, really thankful for all of that. Again, until the next one, stay safe out there. And thanks for tagging along with Tour Time with Tyler.